Off camera I burnt eggshells and with great force of sun I dried it and it turned out there is 192 grams of dry eggshells. I need 274 grams of 80% acetic acid. And naturally you can use just vinegar uh, 10 or 5% and later it turned out that this would be better to use. So here's the reaction container. I added all of my acid and left it overnight uh, only to find out that I have too little water and calcium acetate precipitated out. I found 5 liter plastic bottle and poured the mixture with scrubbed out crystals. That was really pain to uh, move that cluster of uh, crystals, eggshells and ashes, then added additional one and a half liter of water and then left for another night. Uh, there was uh, a lot of ash and other impurities so obviously I had to filter it, uh, this time with not so great force of gravity. After that I had to filter it again, I can start evaporation process. It took me four days but after a long time uh, I finally had my uh, dry crystals. Okay, so here's my bag of um, calcium acetate. As I said, th that's still yellowish, but it doesn't matter. Ooh. <laughs> and now I uh, wipe it. Hundred ninety seven grams. So, yeah, in another video, I'll use uh, that calcium acetate to make acetone. Subscribe my channel to not miss that video, and, and thanks for watching. Bye.